He tells me, well, what do you want me to do? Did you want me to call Honda or call a dealership? I'm like, that's exactly what you're supposed to do. <laughs> like, are you serious? I don't understand this. Did you get other estimates to fix this bike? Um, Mr. what I did... Shh, shh. I'm sorry, ma'am. That's either a yes or a no. Did you get any other estimates to fix the bike? No, I did not, ma'am. What I do have estimates for is he gave me a receipt of only repairing three items. No, listen to me carefully, and, sir. Yes, ma'am. You said in your complaint, the original estimate I got was $7,000. Oh, yes. It was the, parts the... and labor. That's what you say in your complaint. Yes. So when I asked you the question, did you get any other estimates? The answer yes, was yes. Yes, ma'am. And the estimate that you got was $2,000 more than his estimate. Yes, ma'am. Did you have a written contract with him? No, ma'am. Because the bike looks okay. And I don't know the difference between plastic and resin and aftermarket. Those are the kinds of things you're looking for things. Those are the kind of things that you usually put in a contract. So this bike looks okay to me. And I assume it rides. Yes, it does, ma'am. Okay. So, since you don't have a contract that specified what materials he was going to use, do you have any communication with him that suggests that he was to use certain kinds of material to fix the bike? Yes, ma'am. Great. Um, I'd like to see it. In the beginning of him starting to work on the bike, um, no, no, I... Now he's got the bike already. Yes. I'm talking to you. Let's be very clear. Right. I, I kind of got to get to it, though, ma'am. What's up? I don't know what this is. That's why I was trying to explain it to you. Is this what he says he's going to do? With the exception of the Jump after... Up. This is what he said he was going to do. Yes, ma'am. So I want you to circle for me where a particular kind of plastic was going to be. He had gotten a crash estimate, and he wanted a cheaper price on the repairs. At which okay. point, he brought me a parts list. Okay. So these were the parts that were going to be supplied to you from the other place for $7,000. Yes, ma'am. For parts alone. Shh. You gave him that list and you said to him, can you match this? I wanted him to, to help me do it for cheaper. So when he came to the, to, the, to the house, two of those parts he automatically identified didn't need to be replaced, which was the tank, which it's highlighted on this one for $1,100, and the radiator which is for, for $900. So that takes you from 7,000 to 5,000 real quick. So he didn't do anything for me. He didn't save me no money. All he did was not well, replace saved, two parts. Shh, just a second. It's not that he didn't save you money, sir, because the first person that you went to was charging you for something that you didn't need. So he wasn't saving you anything because if you had gone with the first estimate that you got, you would have gotten a radiator and you would have gotten another part that you didn't need. So when he said to you, you don't need it, the bike is right. fine without it. And I assume the bike is fine without it because you are riding the bike. Yes, ma'am. So if you're riding the bike, he was correct that you didn't need those two parts because you didn't put them in, can, right? Can, can, can. So he was correct. Okay. Just. Can, can, so, can. not okay. So, this guy was trying to cheat you. Negative, ma'am. Um, the, as... the radiator was bent, and when you're doing an insurance claim, insurance doesn't want to pay anything more than what they have to. Um, the tank cover is damaged. It's just not damaged to the point that it makes the bike unserviceable. Just a minute. Is radiator... what you're telling me that you took this for an insurance claim? Yes, ma'am, because I had an accident. Just a second. Did the other company have insurance? Yes, ma'am. That's, that's what I'm going to court for, ma'am. And the other company made the assessment. They saw the, the estimate. They, they approved the estimate. You know the other party's insurance is not going to approve an estimate on a part that doesn't need to be replaced. Just a second. I'm going to get back to where I was before. <laughs> okay, ma'am. <laughs>